divines i'm back with another reading today i'm going to be reading for my aquarius so take what resonate and leave the rest so let's go ahead and get into it with today's reading also if it's not resonating make sure you check out your moon and rising sun and maybe you can get some energy from that reading as well and some guidance okay so Source, please give us some information for our Aquarius, what they can use, what they can gain. Okay, clarity, confirmation, insight, and guidance. Clarity, confirmation, insight, and guidance. Okay, so that card popped out. I'm going to do two more cards for you. And that one. Okay, let's go ahead and get started, my guys. So the first card, ooh, three of pentacles. Ooh, a naked woman, honey. Wow, somebody's studying, somebody definitely watching. This person is definitely watching, studying. Okay, three's a couple wanting partnership. Somebody's wanting their relationship back. Okay, wow. Ooh, Queen of Pentacles. Look at your energy. This can definitely be Taurus energy. Okay. Um, but also I'm seeing a woman, someone can be pregnant. It doesn't have to be, but Pinnacles, pinnacles. So I'm saying you can also be dealing with Taurus Virgo. I'm also feeling Libra with this energy. But Empress is somebody who is definitely on their shit. Well, not Empress, but Queen of Pentacles. Someone who's definitely comfortable working towards their corn. Are you working towards your corn? Ooh, Ace of Cups. Okay, Aquarius. So this is this type of reading for you. Okay, Aquarius. So you are definitely falling in love. For some of you, I'm seeing marriage. This person truly love you. This person want a new beginning. Okay, this person want to start something new. Let's get some more energy from this card. I'm seeing working. This person is definitely studying you. This can be somebody you work with or just somebody that shares similar values. Wow. Oh, finally, a beautiful ass reading. Let's see. Oh. Look at this energy, Seven of Wands. Very defensive type of energy. You're fighting. Do you feel like there's somebody at work that you have to be in competition with or just some issues with? Or I'm also seeing, let me see. Let me get some more. Just defensive ass energy. They can feel that you're being very defensive. This new love can feel like you're being defensive. Then you got the Empress. Like I said, something with children. Look, it's the, almost the same person. If you look at it, um... Mmm, women. Ooh, lots of women, honey. I don't know if this person getting advice from like a mother or sister or friends, but they're very defensive. I'm also seeing something with children. Let's get some more energy from these cards, honey. What in the hell happened? Are you having to fight people different egos or people? Let's see. Oh my. Are some of y'all dealing with a Scorpio? You have the tabard. <gasps> Did this love burn and crash? Look at the people now. They're out. Oh, no. Or are you hesitant about this person because of what you've been through? But I'm seeing this love. Oh, my gosh. It's a shock. Somebody was pregnant. Oh, for some of you, did you find out somebody was pregnant or they still dealing with some um, their ex-wife or their ex-husband? Baby mother's baby father energy drama I'm seeing too. Damn, Aquarius, but you came out so happy. How did this happen? Let's go ahead and get some more energy from this person. What in the hell happened? Look, I'm pulling these two cards on. Oh my goodness. It's the cycles for me. Capricorn energy. Wow, Aquarius. Going through low vibrational shit. Toxic cycles okay this person is very toxic oh you honey this started out as first love ended as devil energy wow this motherfucker got you fucked up and look at you you like oh hell nah honey because i've been working on my motherfucking self honey i already know i'm the queen of pentacles you ain't about to come and take down shit also you definitely got your guards up aquarius which you should which you should. You got this devil-ass energy. Oh, you're just sick and tired. Oh, my God. This energy reminds me of the reading I just did with Scorpio. And it's crazy because the tower came up in Scorpio. Wow. You're sick and tired. You want rest and peace. You're just trying to get away from this person. Are some of you pregnant by this person? Oh, my gosh. I hope not. Sick? Some Somebody sick with COVID? Or you just sick and tired of this motherfucker? Okay, honey. 
justice, Libra energy. Ooh, something has to do with court or legal. Is this not right, child support court? Custody court or just court? You're just tired of going back and forth, having to fight, having to defend yourself. I am so sorry, Aquarius. This person got you fucked up. I am so sorry. So, y'all yeah, saying you want a new, either new love or new love and concentrate on your business and your money. That's what I'm seeing. Let's see. Oh, the moon, Pisces energy. I'm seeing secrets. Wow, there were secrets about this love. Oh, there were secrets, illusions. Not everything had appeared to what it was. Oh, five of fucking cups. Look, she's concentrating on all the things that's not going right, but she do have shit that's going right for her, okay? This doesn't have to be just a female. This can be male, too. Wow. There are all things. I'm seeing you looking at this tower energy, looking at who you was, who you used to be, saying, you know, I fought for who I am for how to get here, and I'm just tired. Some of y'all saying y'all just tired of fighting, honey. Y'all just going to throw yourself into work. And then you have the king of pentacles. So interesting. We do have queen and pentacle. I mean, the queen and the king. So we do have soulmate types of energy, okay? Or twin flame type of energy. But we do have secrets and buy new love. So there's something about a love that you're not, there's something about this person that you are so connected with that you just don't understand or you feel like they're hiding some shit from you. And it's just letting you down because you have so many hopes and dreams for this person. And now the shit ain't working out. And y'all both are so similar, but y'all so different. Six of Cups. I'm just keep seeing something with kids. Or maybe they're just so fucking immature. Something about a relationship with children or they how they grew up. Or just it's just them. Then you got the chariot. Can be dealing with a cancer. Moving on. This thing, you about to move on. Look, right beside the five of cups, you're moving on. So this is this is lessons, honey. This is cycles for you some hard cycles, but you're going to get through it, honey. You got the justice. Everything's going to return back balance. Five of wands. Oh my gosh. Fighting with friends and family. This person you thought was very stable end up being more chaotic than you or more chaotic than what they appear to be. Wow, honey. Let's go ahead and get some resolution. What is the energy of this overall person? What is the energy of this overall person, honey? They took you to it, honey. I'm seeing backstab. Shocking truth, shocking revelations. I'm saying for some of you has to do with a, a significant person, okay? Wow. Somebody they said they're not fooling with anymore. Wow. Head games, three, six, or nine. So when you see these numbers, please remember this reading or this. these numbers can already obtain uh, pertain to you. But hey, games, this person are playing or manipulators. This is a manipulator, honey. But they're playing with the magician. That's why I don't understand. <laughs> they're playing with you like you don't know what the hell they doing. You already know. You already can sense the shit. You already got this energy up because you already know deep inside you the damn empress. So you already know and you're just tired of the shit. Like I'm so tired of going through these cycles. But this cycle, you know, even though you was in the dark about some shit, it fall, you finally realized it and it kind of had you battling with yourself talking about how can I make these same mistakes again but they're not same mistakes they, they're there to push you to help you grow to challenge yourself to look into yourself to draw a better picture for you okay no matter what this person this person is giving you head games they're not clear I'm not I'm not seeing run away I'm not seeing this person can't change or this person is dealing with other shit but it's a lot of things they're not telling you the truth okay you're not you don't know everything they're playing games with you let's go ahead and get an oracle card to get some more clarity and guidance okay this is from your higher self your tomorrow self let's see Ooh, Aquarius they got you fucked up Oh my gosh, I'm seeing master manipulators. Oh, this is just like Scorpio's reading, you guys. You have to check that reading out. Protection. Wow, it's saying call back your power, cut the cold soul retrievals. It's saying cut this motherfucker out. Cut this motherfucker out. He is playing head games or he or she is playing head games with you. You're so tired of looking at all the shit you done done for people and they just flip the fuck over like it didn't happen. You're so tired of that. And I understand that Aquarius. And your shit, the center of your reading, you have this tavern. You have this 
new beginning, okay? This new beginning. I do see new love, but this person was new, and y'all was trying to restart, rekindle some shit, but some secrets came out, honey, can have to do with children or just their childish ass behavior. Um, I'm also seeing moving on. You're trying to move on from the bullshit. You're just tired, honey. You're tired of dealing with this toxicity. You're ready for things to be right. You're ready to get back on your fucking game and P's and Q's, okay? You're just tired of the fighting, but you're going to fight for your peace. You're going to fight for your coins. I'm seeing that. You're going to fight for your coins. And this is saying take back that power. Take back that peace. Take back your peace and cut those cords. Cut those cords. Let this person go. Stop being so defensive, and open up to your empress energy and i hope this reading resonate i hope it gave you some guidance please if you have scorpio in your chart or you're dealing with a scorpio please check out the scorpio reading and thank you this has been another divine honesty